dear students welcome to my channel dr v r pudli professor of management and economics in this video i am dealing with different types of research types of research one descriptive research descriptive research involves description of the state of affairs as it exists at present descriptive research includes surveys and fact finding inquiries of different kinds two analytical research in analytical research the researcher uses facts or information already available and analyze these to make a critical evaluation of the material three applied research applied research aims at finding a solution for an immediate problem that a society or a business organization is facing four fundamental research fundamental research is mainly concerned with generalizations and with the formulation of a theory this is also called pure research or basic research gathering knowledge for knowledge sake is termed as pure research research concerning some natural phenomena or relating to pure mathematics or examples of fundamental research five quantitative research quantitative research is based on the measurement of quantity or amount it is applicable to a phenomena that can be expressed in terms of quantity six qualitative research qualitative research is concerned with qualitative phenomena that is phenomena relating to or involving quality or kind qualitative research is specially important in the behavioral sciences where the aim is to discover the underlying motives of human behavior seven conceptual research conceptual research is that research which is related to some abstract idea or theory it is generally used by philosophers and thinkers to develop new concepts or to reinterpret existing ones eight empirical research empirical research relies on experience or observation alone often without due regard for system and theory it is data based research coming up with conclusions which are capable of being verified by observation or experiment we can also call it as experimental type of research in empirical research the researcher must first provide himself with a working hypothesis he then works to get you know facts or data to prove or disprove his hypothesis nine one time research in one time research the research is confined to a single time period then longitudinal research 
in case of longitudinal research the research is carried on over several time periods 11 clinical or diagnostic research clinical or diagnostic research follow case study methods or in depth approaches to reach the basic causal relations such studies usually go deep into the causes of things or events that interest us using very small samples and very deep probing data gathering devices 12 exploratory research the objective of exploratory research is the development of hypotheses rather than their testing 13 formalized research formalized research studies are those which involve substantial structure and specific hypotheses to be tested 14 historical research historical research utilizes historical sources like documents remains etc to study events or ideas of the past including the philosophy of persons and groups at any remote point of time 15 conclusion oriented research in conclusion oriented research a researcher is free to pick up a problem redesign the inquiry as he proceeds and is prepared to conceptualize as he wishes 16 decision oriented research decision oriented research is always carried out for the need of a decision maker and the researcher in this case is not free to embark upon research according to his own inclination 17 policy research policy research is designed to examine the effects of current government or social policies or predict the potential effects of proposed policies as those effects relate to the distribution or redistribution of resources 18 inductive research this is also known as theory building research and is designed to collect data that may help to develop a new theory about a process or phenomenon inductive research moves from the specific to the general 19 deductive research this is also known as theory testing research this research is the opposite of inductive research and moves from the broad to the specific 20 field setting research this research is conducted in field 21 laboratory research this research is conducted in laboratory 22 simulation research this research is conducted in simulated environment dear students in this video we had learned about different types of research thank you